get you out the door this morning. 647 Andy's track in your forecast. Yeah, let's get to it. Some of the best video that we can show you this morning happened in only 15 minutes, even though it was a day's worth of weather. Take a look as we start the clock and what's going to appear out of the mist is that gust front, the cold front as it arrives and slams into downtown Buffalo, kind of a rolling cloud right along the water. And after that, you didn't see anything in the city. Here's the live view outside right now. You can see uh, one of the markers out there, the three break walls. You can go pretty far in the distance. We have some raindrops falling from the sky. We're at 50 degrees now. That may prove to be the warmest temperature that we achieved the entire day. Winds out of the southwest at 13. Those are going to pick up this afternoon, so pay attention to this one. You're going to need the umbrellas this morning. Look at that. That's snow on the back side of this weather system. We're on the warmer side. Believe it or not, 50 is actually warmer. They're in the 30s this morning there. Now, this water is going to transition along the length of Lake Erie, not nearly as strong as it was yesterday, but we're going to find scattered showers through the morning. Already starting to see those beginning to become more frequent dots on the map. Nothing as strong as yesterday. Want to emphasize that again. Not as much rain, more of a nuisance to everybody. Buddy. We're going to produce a few puddles down here between Jamestown and Bradford. Olean, you've already seen a little bit, and then this will slide through Warsaw. We're already getting a bit in downtown Buffalo. Sending that your way, Batavia, as we start the morning. Everybody's on uh, either side of 50 by a degree or two. Even the lake is at 48, but I think we're going to put the halt on that. It went quick up to that point, but this week is going to really just shut the door on any increase in that temperature. Boy, today we're going to find the numbers dipping down a few degrees, but this afternoon it won't be the rain, it'll be the wind as the rain kind of tapers off. The wind picks up and we could see some gusts today up to 50 miles an hour. That's why we've got the gust index here. Not quite to a severe level, but enough to tip trash cans and you'll get some branches broken as we'll see some maximum gusts up to 50 miles an hour. Everyone but Allegheny County involved in a wind advisory today, but it'll be breezy down there nonetheless. Let me take you through the day hour by hour so you can plan your afternoon. This is when you're going to want the umbrellas between not or eight, nine and noon. That's when we'll have the best chance of seeing the rain showers around western New York. Then as the winds take over, boy, they're going to drive the rain north and south of the city. So downtown Buffalo, a good chunk of western New York between Buffalo, Batavia and Rochester dry out during the afternoon. If you're in the southern tier, you'll continue with those scattered showers in Niagara Falls. You can expect to get wet as well. As we get to the evening hours, the rain showers taper off and then we start looking ahead. Tomorrow is the only dry day we have out of the next seven. A pair of 53s on Wednesday and Thursday, and it looks like Wednesday may be a day that we start to dry out a little bit, but I'm telling you, coming Thursday afternoon, the morning is dry, but the second half of the day, we could get between one and two inches of rain from Thursday evening to Saturday morning. Friday may be the warmest day there, but that is going to be a soaker. Get your sump pumps ready, and hopefully you'll be prepared for another inch or two of water. Some indoor activities over the weekend, absolutely. Look at this, 40s for daytime highs. We should be near 60 this time of year. So many people sent in the pictures. We appreciate it. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you can find us all. And it's this crew right here that'll keep you one step ahead of the weather changes as they come. Let's start the sprint.